What a busy day it has been since I got home. So, I got home. My mom came and picked me up. We went downtown and then Strudel's mom was gonna be in town. I can't remember if I mentioned that. So I texted her, I was like, hey, you wanna go for lunch? Where are you, when are you coming in? And then we grabbed a snack and we sat so we could watch the ocean. I'm like, oh, there she is, coming in. And so we went and bugged her for a bit, but she didn't have time to stop for food. I have to get socks off, it is warm. She didn't have so blah, 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 blah. She didn't have time to stop for food because like she had a bunch of errands she had to run in between, blah, blah, blah. And um, so we hung out for a bit. I said my official final goodbye, but I'm pretty sure I'll be back there soon enough. And then I was texting my boss at the theater and he's like, oh, it's Latte Tuesday. And um, so I was like, oh yeah, well, I'm not coming into work, but buy me a latte and I'll be there. I eat hot chocolate. And so my mommy and I went for lunch. It was like I've been like craving white spot for a couple weeks now and it just wasn't as good as I hoped it would be, but that's okay. And then we went to the theater, so I said hi to everybody. Found out that I have a whole department un under me now. I don't know, I'm senior rank in that department because they hired people since me. So that's cool, which means that if I wanna take time off or if, I guess I'm taking off my pants, or if I wanna like, go back to Blind Channel to work for a bit. I can do those things. And there's people there, so that is awesome. I have to look at the schedule. I've got it here, um, and I have to figure out what shifts I want. Because senior, senior, senor, the senior staff means that I get first dips at everything. So that's very exciting. I'm starting at work on Friday. I'm so excited to have today and tomorrow off. All, no, tomorrow and the next day off. And um, yeah, I got a hot chocolate. Everyone was so happy to see me, which was awesome. Went to Walmart to get a few essentials. Easy mat for my workplace snacks. And then naturally I went to a store and I got pens. I don't actually have these colors, so it's fine. I need more colors. And then just some groceries and stuff because I got to feed myself tonight um, at some point. But yeah, I'm really tired. I'm gonna find some pants because I'm literally standing here in my underwear right now. I'm gonna find some pants and open a window because it is quite warm in here, which is like such a drastic change because it's been so crappy late. Well, it was nice the last couple days, but it's been pretty crappy. And then maybe get some vlogs going up or maybe just enjoy this bed, this beautiful, beautiful beast. Yeah, but we will see. All right, so I've been home for hours. 11-ish, five hours, something like that, and they went over it away, but do you, there's, it's a mess back there. It's a mess right here. Oh yeah. Oh, there's my chair. Yeah, see, I was confused. I didn't even know where my, co my coffee chair was. Oh my god, my computer chair. We are doing well with the brain. Um, there was an electrical issue. I can't remember if I mentioned it. So like it's been apparently rolling blackouts. So a friend of ours was here because they didn't know when I'd be back. And so the electrician came and nothing changed. He's like, I don't know if this fixed anything. And I remembered when we first moved in that the baseboard heaters were, cons were all shut off. And I was like, well, maybe that'll help. And so I turned off the baseboard heaters, the ones downstairs, and within like five to ten minutes, the power went back on upstairs and in the room next door, because it's weird, like, this room and that room and the bathroom were fine, and that room and that room were fine, and part of the living room was fine. It's really weird. It seems like the wiring is weird in this house. But anyway, so I feel a little bit safer knowing that the breakers are off on these guys and the power's on on everything else. I'm gonna monitor it closely of course um, and then maybe reach out to my sister-in-law and let her know my findings. I look exhausted. It's probably because I am. I'm just downloading some more white collar because I bought the series while I was in Blind Channel but really downloaded like three of the episodes because the internet is so bad so just gonna download some more and then at some point I'm gonna eat. I feel like I should unpack, but also I'm super lazy. I just, I feel kind of like sick too because this room that, where is it? The panel there 
where the uh, electrical stuff is, there's... It has a smell that comes out of it that makes me feel very sick and very ill. So, it's not like mold or anything, it's just um, insulation and stuff. But yeah, I already like have a headache and my breathing is... So that's fun. But anyways, I'm just chilling like a villain, a very tired villain. Um, my mom, I sent stuff to my mom's house while I was away and so I'm hoping she'll come bring it to me because she didn't bring it to me when she picked me up but I got a new water bottle because I shattered my Brita water bottle well the top of it. I was really mad one day, I don't remember if I mentioned it but I was really mad one day and I dropped it and it broke and then I proceeded to drop it like another five times since there and every time I was like this is it, this is the end, it's not going to survive but every time it came back so that was good but I left it in the garbage at Blind Channel because yeah that's done and I ordered a new one and that arrived today as well as some other things I don't know I sent a lot of stuff to her house because I have a minor shopping problem when I'm in the middle of nowhere and have internet access I'm like ooh, what are these things I can get but yeah so there's a couple packages there I am so tired I'm so tired should I just sleep I feel like I need to eat food at some point and also like clear a path to the door because it's not cleared that way and that I sleep on the side of bed. Anyways, uh, I'm rambling. I also need to upload videos, but I mean, what's another day? Alrighty, it is happening. I am uploading some vlogs. Very exciting. Um, I think I have like three or four to upload and no, five. I don't know, but then I need to edit because I have not edited anything since. Let me find it. The 28th of August. It's the 10th of September. I'm going to combine weeks though, I think, because that'll help me get caught up pretty quickly here. I'm also still really exhausted. I'm watching some YouTube over here, some Alicia Marie. And um, then I'm going to make some food once I get everything uploading, I think. Yeah, two more that I need to get ready to go. I feel so sick still. And then I'm going to go make some food. I'm being productive. I said I wasn't going to be, but I can't not be productive. It's very difficult. And I'm just being productive in my bed, though. So it's like a, it's a compromise. But yeah. <sighs> okay, so I am back downstairs just chilling. I ate dinner. The power still is on. So I'm not resetting the clock on the um, uh, oven slash stove so I can know if it goes off. Or I can know like how long it's been on for. I guess I could reset it. Whatever. Anyways, I'll know if it goes off because the internet will go out. So far, internet is still going strong and I'm just catching up on YouTube videos. So I'm being kind of lazy, but I did upload five videos. So I'm not being that lazy. I am going to try to get moving here in a bit. And also I'm going to try to like be like, Mama, can you please bring me my mail? So... We'll see if that happens. I also want to go to the store maybe to get some Aveeno cream because I got so many bug bites while I was out in Blind Channel this summer and my legs are so dry and I just, yeah, they need, they need some love. But anyways, we're fine. I am going to watch another video here and then I think I'm going to try to be productive. Something about that pile of everything over there maybe throwing a load of laundry I don't know we'll see what we do okay look I'm I'm finally out of the bed um it is quarter to eight what even um and I'm starting to slowly unpack I think but it's really just taking things out of things which I know is unpacking and piling them places like there I just like I don't even know how to start also I got my google home nest with Nest Hub, Nest Hub, Google Nest Hub set up there. And so I have a baby speaker here now, but then I think the thing that's the most hilarious are the two free ones that I got. So again, when I bought my Nest Hub, I got this for free. And then because I'm a Google, Google something, Google One member, and I pay for Google monthly for more storage. They're like, want a free one? And I was like, sure, I'll pay shipping. I have a problem. If people offer me free things, I'm like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, it is, like I said, just before eight, my legs are so dry and so bitten up from all the bugs. And I think I mentioned earlier that I was thinking about going to the store. Well, now I've decided that I think I want ice cream. So I'm probably going to go to the store. That includes, that, that means I have to like put on pants. So, so I'm, 
I think that's what I'm trying I'm, I'm thinking about doing I'm bad with the English I was thinking of putting on clothes to go to the store so I'm gonna try to find some clothes I'm thinking sweats sweats and just like some sandals and I gotta put on a bra because I'm not wearing a bra it's been great but yeah so I think I'm gonna do that and I will keep you posted I don't know why I always do this I don't know why okay so I'm just back from the store and uh, go up here everyone should be very proud of me because I wasn't gonna be I wasn't gonna bring my reusable bag because I didn't want to carry it over but I did um so I went over kind of mostly for ice cream which I don't really want anymore typical and uh, but also mostly for my god my brain why is it working anti-itch cream Avino anti-itch cream because my legs are so bad and they're so dry and so I figure that's the best solution right I tried putting on some cream that I have and it just made everything sting which is not good anyway so that's what I tried to get but the anti-itch cream this lighting is terrible I'll just hold this then. The anti-itch cream has some sort of thing in it that makes it expire, so I always check things. Since I worked at a drugstore, I always check things. And they expired in May. It is September. So I was like, I don't want to buy this because it might not be effective, and then that's just like $12 down the drain. But they didn't really have anything else. I thought about calamine lotion, but my legs are also super dry, so I just went for the Aveeno Skin Relief Moisturizing Lotion. So I'm hoping that that will do something to help me. It says soothes, 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 itchy, extra dry skin and moisturizes for 24 hours. So I'm hopeful that that's going to help. And then I kind of blacked out. Well, no, I wanted ice cream. It was on sale too, which was super awesome. $3.99. That's a good price. Um, but this is where I blacked out. I got, I put them up in the freezer already, but I got like the hash brown potato patties because I've been craving them recently i don't even normally eat them but i just have been craving them and then because i was sad about the lotion i got my favorite chocolate milk which is this avalon chocolate milk and if you return the bottle then they reuse them which is awesome anyway so that's the thing that happened this most definitely needs to go in the freezer Ugh. and then oh look there's some little ice cream in there from who knows when and when i went to the grocery store the grocery store is near the movie theater and i was like Maybe I want to see a movie, and Angel Has Fallen is on, and so I'm like, should I go see that? It's playing at like 20 to 10 tonight, though, and I don't know if I'll make it, but it is, it's 20 after 8, so I think I'll reassess as it gets closer to the time, but currently I'm just gonna take this and slather it all over my body, and also, like, consider that, because I walked in, I'm like, I'm gonna go to the movie, and then I was like, maybe I shouldn't, so we'll see. Well, hello, it is 10 o'clock, and honestly, I am... So eating cobweb. I am surprised I have lasted this long, to be honest. I don't know what I was thinking about. Like, I should go to a movie because, mm-mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> I would have, like, even if I went and stayed awake the whole time, I would have regretted having to walk home at the end of it. So, decided not to. Instead, I cleared my desk area and there was a suitcase where I'm sitting right now. Suitcase is now on the couch. I've just piled everything in the corner back there because I'm lazy. But I'm going to now make a list for tomorrow. Love me my lists. And um, then probably climb into bed and watch some more white collar because I think that's exactly what I need. Make a list for tomorrow. I'm like all thrown off because I'm still, like I made my list or I did, I filled out my agenda and it said go home on Thursday, but it's Tuesday and I came home. And so, yeah, I got an extra day here. <sighs> so, my vlog, my vlog, my life, my life is a little bit off based on what I planned, but it is fine. I am not doing well here with the brain functioning and the, the words. It was actually really funny when we were coming into town, like the closer we got to town, the worse my English got and my boss was like, what the heck? And I'm like, I don't know, I don't know. It's just happening. But yeah, so I'm soon going to be in my bed with my laptop watching some white collar. But before I do that, I want to make a list of things for tomorrow. Oh my God, it's just everything's a mess, everything's a mess. I have like notes from when I was doing 
invoicing and billing, but mostly I just want these new pens like gorgeous. <laughs> so anyways, write list. Stop getting so distracted. Oh, why did I put these in there? Um, climb into bed. That's a very simple thing. I will check in with you in a little bit once my list is written and I'm going to sleep. Okay, I set up my list for tomorrow. The entire sheet is full and there's more stuff I probably could write down that I'm missing or whatever, but it's fine. I, these little baby hairs just drive me nuts. I am exhausted. It is, did I just say it's 1030? Because it's 1030. Wow. I'm tired. If you can't tell, I get to sleep in tomorrow. It's going to be wonderful. I'm going to just put my phone on Do Not Disturb. And I swear to God, if anybody tries to wake me up, I'm going to murder them. I'm not actually going to, but I'm going to plot revenge. Definitely. Anyways, with that, I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along in today's adventure where I'm now back in the real world and trying to get life back together. Life was so much simpler when it was confined to a very small island, but, you know, we'll get this going now, soon. Oh, the brain is not going well. And I will see you tomorrow when... I'm fully refreshed, hopefully, and we do that. <laughs> Good night.